when you uh, <gasps> cut it. It's <laughs> How dare you? Okay, Justin, this is gonna be uh, a different kind of setup today because we're doing two hot sauces from two different companies. All right. Because um, I believe that these are gonna be flavor forward sauces and they're single sauces, so I wanted to, I, basically I'm trying, I wanna provide more content for you guys. And so, I don't, I, I would never make a single video on one of these sauces, but with their powers combined, we can do a video. Make the ultimate video. And just give the freaking action figure, how cool is this? This is from Bio, 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 Bio. That's the word. Gotham hot sauce. They're from New York City, I believe. But Bayou. New York, New York. This is some like Louisiana slash New they're, York City. They're bringing situation. Louisiana the big apple. Going on. Chinatown, New York City was once ruled by secret crime syndicates flooding along blind street corner known as the Bloody Angle. Engaged in a, in a potent clash of heat and flavor. A noir homage to a place full of zest beyond generations of time. What a freaking thing. It came with a freaking... Action figure. Is that who fought the crime? I don't know. I hope. But it came with an action figure. And it comes with this like graduation tassel too. It's pretty nuts. And then from Bali Made, this is their black sambal chili sauce. Um there is no description. Nope. From the Isle of the Islands of Spice, unique flavors for, of Indonesia. Try black sambal on anything you'd like for a unique experience to your next meal. Um, I am very excited for both of these sauces. I'm not going to take this guy out of the packaging. No, you leave. Be, he's leave, beautiful. Leave right. it as is. The presentation is well done. I'm going to put him right back. He, he lives on the set now. Right back on the set. Okay. Where do you want to start? Uh, I don't know. I think we're starting with the black sambal because this one is pretty fancy looking. So he sits off to the side and looks good. Yeah. I have two. I got two. There you go. Okay. Ingredients are interesting. <laughs> is that the number one ingredient? No. <laughs> so there's a, uh, there's like, a, there's not a typo going on, <laughs> but they're lacking in commas here, but I know what they're doing. So, okay. so it's soy, tomato, onion, Thai chili, Canola oil, brown sugar, salt, garlic, and citric acid. This is going to be freaking sweet, sticky deliciousness. Is what this is going to be. Let's do it then. So Thai chilies are the hottest pepper in here. Which I can't even talk. I tried to get no words. Did came you up. hear that? Nothing. It no, like, I didn't hear it. That's it, the thing. It was like a whisper. <laughs> it was like uh. a, puff, a puff of words. A puff <laughs> happened. I got issues today, man. Okay, this is this is gonna be tasty. Uh, do you see the what it, they think it pairs with on the so other side? What are the pairings here? Flip it over. There you go. Ah, get get your spice on. Chicken, beef, pork, fish, rice, and tofu. So pretty much any meats. So you name it. Yep, it goes on everything. Oh my god, that smells so savory. Like the oh my god, it pours like molasses. It looks like ink. Yes. God, it is just dark. It smells that, I smell that soy. Black as I night. Smell, yeah, it's soy. Just soy. Yep. Soy, sticky, beautifulness. Oh mm -hmm. my God, it's gonna be tasty. Cheers. That is a lot of flavor. That is powerful. This is powerful. Soy up front. I've never said that about a sauce so much. Powerful is the word for it. It is a soy explosion. This is the, okay, this is That's the first. Good. That's this, a little spicier than I expected too. It's hotter. And this is the first time that I've ever said this about a hot sauce, I think. You don't need much of this. No, no. Like. No, a little will go a long way with you this. You tread lightly because it's so, it's almost like it's concentrated. That, yeah, it really does. It's, it, this tastes like a hot sauce concentrate. Yep. Like, I wanna cut this. Dilute it Like down dilute, a I wanna bit. like dilute it down yep. with something. Yep. Like that is how like jam-packed with flavor it is. It's yep. almost too much. What's that secondary flavor I'm getting? I mean, I'm getting a lot of soy. It's soy up front, but there's something like it's kind of backburnered on it a little brown, bit. Brown sugar? It's the brown sugar. The it's oil? The it's the sweetness, yeah, from like, the brown sugar. It is. It's like a, the sweet on the second part you know, of it. Like, I want to put this in ramen. Yeah, absolutely. I want to put this on top of rice. Yep. Um, you can glaze this like a barbecue sauce, like, it's super good, powerful, it's, but so good. Powerful is the best descriptor yep. for this. Yep. Um, I mean, heat scale, two, 
mid one. One? Yeah, two. one to two. Somewhere between a one and a two. It's higher than a one, I'm going to say. Probably. There's somewhere in that middle range of yeah, that. Yeah, we're, we're dancing around the one to two, but I'm going to say it's a little bit. It's hotter it's than. It's not a straight one. It's hotter than Frank's or Tabasco yeah. or something like yeah. that. Yeah. It's quick, though. I can't believe how, like, like viciously flavorful this yep. is. Incredible. Incredible. It's uh, very tasty. Mm hmm. Wow. But so. It, it is, it's aggressive. This is an aggressive hot sauce. Strong, powerful, aggressive. Okay. I'm gonna open the bottle that doesn't have the tassel on it, even though the tassel is easily removed. I'm gonna keep it right there. Okay. Have you had sauces from this hot sauce company? Before? I don't think so. What's it called? Oh, the Bayou? I don't think Bayou so. Bayou Gotham? I don't think so. I've done them before. Really? I don't, know if, I don't know if you were I don't think for. I was here for it. Doesn't sound familiar. Let us know. But we've done so many videos. I know. So. All right, it was salvaged. It was salvaged. Manufactured in the USA by Scotty Pepper's Hot Sauce Company. I like that. Scotty Pepper's. <coughs> I love that. Scotty Pepper's? I'm a, I grew up in the 90s watching basketball. Of course. I like that. <laughs> Sichuan Habanero, Zing Dynasty. The Hito Meter. Ooh, they got a Hito Meter on this. This is a medium. All the way up the, it goes all the way up to blazing. Okay. Ingredients in this are tamari. I don't even know what that is. It's a gluten-free soy sauce. Oh, okay. Um, brown sugar. Number two ingredient. Two. Number two. Balsamic vinegar, rice vinegar, shallots, garlic, red habanero, tangerine juice, ginger, roasted sesame oil, Sichuan peppercorn, shiitake mushroom powder. I think it's going to be sweet up front and then that back burner savory. It's a much thinner sauce. I noticed that when you when you uh, <gasps> cut it. It's... <laughs> How dare you, freaking regulator. Trying to tell me how much freaking hot sauce to use. So what are they trying to say? That it's, I don't know. What are you trying to Probably say? Probably because I think that's just a looseness factor. It's extreme. That's what I mean, I think it's a looseness factor. I think there was some accidents and they were like, let's handle these accidents. So this is gonna be crazy vinegar for me. Yeah, because it's the, what, three and four are vinegar, or types of vinegar. Balsamic and rice. And the tamari. Oh yeah. Yeah. So they should be salty. So sweet. that brown that brown sugar is just to tone that down, probably. Dude, I'm, I'm interested to see what so um yeah. Kinda tread lightly in a like I expect this to be like salty, sweet, vinegary. A lot of separation going on in it, it looks like. Kinda kinda loading her up. Oh yeah? I don't know what that is. It smells, like, it, smells, it smells like tamari. It smells like is that tamari. what tamari? Okay. Yeah, it smells like soy sauce. Okay. All right, cheers. That was a lot on a spoon. Um, like sodium salt like content. Um, the soy sauce. It's good though. It's. Let me see that again. It's just like soy sauce. It's very soy sauce. Yeah, forward. it's a soy sauce. It's it's very tamari forward. Very, very, what's the salt content in this? That's uh, it, right. So 170 milligrams of sodium, which is a lot of sodium. So, I mean, you want to go a little bit lighter on the, like, I mean, you're, you're treating this like a- like Treating it like a soy sauce. Yeah. Anything yeah. you would put soy sauce on, you could use this. I like how there's sesame oil in here. I like that there's like the tamari, like, this is a dipping sauce, you yep. know? It's gonna go great. Dumplings. It would great, oh, you dumplings. That's what exact, exactly what I was gonna say. Like, I want some edamame. Yep. Dip some edamame or something like yep. that. Hyper delicious. Um, less, less than the first one. I don't, way less. I mean, round it up to a one. It's like a point five. Yeah, you know? yeah, like, round I'm not, it up. I'm not getting a lot of heat in any way, shape, or form. Roof of my mouth has a little bit, but that's about it. I would say the heat is like definitely an afterthought on this sauce. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely delicious though. Yep. Like this is fantastic. Two very similar sauces, yet so different sauces. Sushi? Sushi you know? would be good too, yeah. Like, you know, that's where I'm going. Yep. Um, I thought dumplings right away though. Yeah, I wanna bring this in like Thai food. Like, that's so many good things. Um, okay, two sauces that have, I would say some similarities and some like huge differences yep. simultaneously. Yep, they're the same, but they're not the same. If that makes sense. I mean, they're, they're very different, but yet yeah. have similar. Yep. Oh yeah. So, like, I've never had a hot sauce that has so much flavor to it. Yeah. Like. Yeah. It packs a punch. 
And I'm not, I'm like, I'm not saying this. It's not a bad thing. I'm not saying it's a good thing or a bad thing. No, it's just, it's, it's, just, it's just a thing. It's something you just need to know before you use it. It's freaking wild. Yep. So jam packed. Yep. Um, and this one is just, fan it's a great dipping sauce. Yep. Yep. Killers. Okay. In the description below is gonna be a link to these two companies. Check them out. Um, very, very tasty. Also link to Justin. He's on channel once a week. All right, love you guys. See you guys on the next one. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, please click the subscribe button that you see right there and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, from now on, I'm gonna be eating a lot of peppers. It's gonna, oh man, it's gonna be great. Bye.